Hey guys, Ash here, and today I'm going to be playing Champions of Nora Thrones of Ever EverQuest. Um, with Comic Zone, I don't have the patience, not so much patience, but the fact that I've not moved, like, from one spot in two episodes kind of frustrates me, and I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to watch me over and over and do the same thing, and so... Um, I decided that I was going to end that, and I'm going to play a game that I can for sure, um, play through. Um, this game I, I should have done a long, long time ago, um, because this is one of my all-time favorite games. I've played it for years, i played it for about, but, uh, 12 years? I've played it since it came out. Um, it's a PlayStation 2 only game. This series, there's two games um, I'll play through. Normally what you do is you'll play through the first three, like the first, well, the all three playthroughs and difficulties on this with the same character because you import it. And then you go on to the next game and play the hardest difficulty. Because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to watch me play through this game three times in a row, I will play through the first difficulty and then import my character to the second game for the second difficulty. Um, I'm not really being quiet about this cutscene, mainly because this game has been out for a really long time, and there's not really much point in me doing that just because I'm talking. Um, so, yeah, this will be part one. I'm going to play through the whole thing. Um, I'm going to be the... I'm contemplating between the Dark Elf and the Wood Elf, um, mainly because those are both two of my, they're both great solo player characters, um, they're both solo characters, great solo characters, um, I put a lot more into a Dark Elf than into a Wood Elf, so I'll probably do the Wood Elf, um, yeah, I've not done tons with the Wood Elf, so I'll probably do that, um, so, this game, I it's a four-player co-op game that you can play. Um, you can play it four-player co-op with, and it's local. It also, I don't know if you can ever get it working anymore, but it used to have online capabilities. Um, you used to be able to play this online with people. Um, I'm just going to do that, and I'm going to make my hair color... Um, I know glitches to this game and cheats, um, I don't feel like using them, mainly because it's just, uh, you know, like if I, if I did it, I would make this character, um, level 20 with some really good stats just to begin with, um, like, I did that with my Barbarian, and he's, like, level 47 on the second game, and he is completely resistant to all elements. It's really fun to play as him. Um, the Barbarian's a really character, a car, a character that's really hard to start off in, um, especially because the first time we played through this, I was the Barbarian, and I did not get past level 15. By the time we beat the game, I was not level 15 when everyone was in their 20s upper 20s, lower 30s, my brother, my sister, my dad and I, um, so he's not the best character to just start off, that's why I used the glitch and the cheat with him, um, once you get him to that point, he's really nice, a really good character, um, but, um, so these will be 20 minutes around each episode, I have no idea how many episodes it'll take me, it just depends. Um, there's not, there's a few side things you can do, I'm not, I don't, I'm not sure about this one, because I've not played this one in a long time, um, but the second one, there are some side stuff that you can do, which I'll probably do, just because it's not insane like, um, newer RPGs are today, um, but if you guys have a PS2, and you've not tried this game, and you're into RPGs, I rec highly recommend this game, um, if you're still into having friends over 
over for a party and you got a multi-tap um, and you guys are looking for a game to get into, this is a great game. Um, when we first got our PS2, we uh, we got a, quite a few games like Battlefront um, and Ratchet and Clank and Star Wars Battle Earth and NFL Street and stuff like that. Um, that we um, played, but this was our first four player game that we got. Um, we got a multi tab of this and Time Splitters 2. Um, also, Fade Arc List is off limits by order of the. The Corys. No exceptions. You're a jerk. Oof. And now I need to. I, re I need to remember that I can't destroy these with my bow in this one. You could destroy. I'm gonna talk to this guy. Oh, you're off to slay the raiders, are you? Well, my hat's off to you. I gave up the adventuring life centuries ago to open this shop. Sonari willing? Things will get back to normal oh, before right, too long. I might have never know what might come in handy. Let's see how many arrows I got. Oh, that is not. Definitely need to equip that. Um, so you can use gate scrolls if you need to get back to town. I'm gonna buy some more arrows. Um, just because you, you never can have enough arrows in this game. My dad and I found that out. Um, he will carry a thousand on him. My dad. Um, we'll carry a thousand on him when he goes into a, to a level, and he'll come back with only, like, a hundred left. So he definitely knows. Alright, so these are the portals. Um, this is the home place, so there's nowhere to go to from here. But, um, that's how I will travel between areas in here, aside from using a gate scroll. This is a save orb. It saved my checkpoint, but the game is not safe, so if I got out, I would be in trouble. If I died, I would come right back here. Um, that's also if you're playing in multiple, with multiple people, and you will, um... Um, if you're playing with multiple people, you will have to go back there and revive them if they die. Um, I haven't installed yet. I'm gonna pick up those rugged patch with gloves. Um, at the moment, you, you can never be sure what's better, see that's, that's better, if not by a lot, it's still better. Um, I'm gonna turn down the music. And the subtitles are already on. Yes, I would like to save my changes. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and see the so if you ever played like Diablo, this, the original Diablo, um, on the PlayStation, it was, um, the PlayStation exclusive two player edition. That is, um, a good comparison. Um, another game that is like this is Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance series. Um, those are good games. I recently, um, got Baldur's Gate 2. I've been for Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance 2, which I've been waiting for for a while. Um, I'm gonna put up my map. I always have my map up there cause, just because it's always useful to find um, exploration and stuff. Um, remember that's the block button. Uh, so this 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 game series, this is probably the main one I have to start to work into back then. Um, I just leave it up. So, really, this game, it, to me, it's what RPGs to focus on. Um, it has a good story, and a lot of people are like, oh yeah, a lot of 
of the use of a good story. It's got difficult gameplay, but not so passionately difficult that you want to rip out your hair. Um, I'm, I'm talking about Dark Souls, and, and, and Dogma can be really difficult at times. Um, there. Witcher 2 I found kind of difficult, um, and you like, well, we're not that different. Well, yeah, kind of, but this one I can play, um, when I get to a certain point, I can play it when sleeping. Um, and some people are like, what? Well, that's not really that fun of a game. But it's not so easy that I'm like, oh, I'm gonna fall asleep kind of thing. Um, like, also, though, um, Dark Souls, you guys can agree with me, is a very punishing difficult game, and a lot of people enjoy it because of that. Um, but, and Witcher 2, it's got, and this game also does not have a speech learning curve. Um, my sister and I at 4 and 5, with 3 and 4, we were really young when we started playing this, and we were like, um, relatively with ease, um, and it didn't take us very long. Uh, so, that's another thing about modern RPGs, and I understand if you want to have better technology, you're going to have to keep learning curve. And, you know, not, they don't make enough games like this where there isn't a sequel learning curve. And I've got nothing against the steep learning curve, it's just some games I prefer just to be able to, you know, not veins popping out and being frustrated because of how difficult the game is. Um, like, um, it's just, it's, sometimes it's better to have games like this. That's why I keep my PS2 and my kind of games. Um, I enjoy it a lot. And I, I, there's not tons of games on my 360 or PS2 that I would be like, oh yeah, in a couple of years I'd be wanting to go back to that. These games I definitely do. Um, it's got a nice system to gem and stuff that you can work on, or you can just leave it alone. It really does not matter too much. Um, sometimes when you're playing on a harder difficulty, which, you know, a lot of people are like, oh yeah, bring on the challenge. And, um, sometimes those aren't always, those, it can be hard at times, you gotta pay attention a lot. If you're playing with four people, even with four people, bosses can be a pain. I'm not even kidding, you. This, this game has made me mad at the right time, not all the time, um, not this one as much as the second one, but and if I do what I think I'm trying to okay, there you go. Sounds almost a lot of times when um my dad and I would do this, um, we would always miss one job. We had no idea how, we would almost always miss one. And so I have to say that I missed one right there. I'm mainly at the moment just because I'm not doing too much tons exploration at the moment. I'm picking up everything I can just so I can start building up my money again. Or building up my money at the moment. Um. And I, I don't remember. I think it's only the Wood Elf and the Barbarian that can do a wheel. Um. To my knowledge. There's also. Let me think. Uh. The Berserker in the second one, he's one of, he's a new character for the second one. There are two new characters, um, which kind of stinks because they're a lot harder to get to level 80. Um, just because you don't get to get a character to 50 in this one and then bring it into that one. Actually, how many arrows do I have? Like I said, I, I want to watch how many arrows I have. And as I start to build up money, I can start buying other things, but mainly I focus on arrows above all else. I will spend all my money on arrows just because it's, it's one of those things as someone who is a more ranged um, character.
all clear, the lift is ready to go. Um, so yeah, this, this game is a game I tried to get Snow hooked on, and he didn't really enjoy it that much. Um, I would wait for more people to do this, but I don't, this game is a lot harder to get, uh, I don't normally have four people at my house at a time, so it's, uh, harder to do. If I wanted a more of a challenge, I probably would have played as the wizard, well, more of a challenge isn't really the word, mainly just because I, um, I played single player as the wizard before. I just prefer others for single play. Aren't you a little overdressed for a stroll through Maydark Forest? Yeah. And maybe you haven't heard. Have you noticed? But we're fighting orcs today. Have you noticed I've got weapons? Your words are wasted on this one, Eodane. It's but another fool who thinks to be a hero. I'm, I'm pretty sure I am a hero. When will the Gorius stop sending them to us? If I... They don't come prepared, they don't if... follow orders, and they don't bathe. They're more trouble than uh, they're we worth. Don't bathe. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mark we don't my words. Time. We'll end up burying this one right next to the others. Is your charm have yeah. them? It's little wonder we don't get more recruits from Fadok's champions. Yeah. You will have to excuse my friend, but he does have a point. If you're here to do battle with the orcs or goblins, you'll need to better equip yourself. I just yourself. killed like 40 of them, pal. Equip with Be nice that I just killed 40 you orcs. Oh, wait, that's right. Provision. You guys were too busy singing. The goblins took here. everything they could lay their hands on. You might as well go home. I, I don't feel the like going home. The heartless master would not be pleased to hear his warrior welcomed with such words, Coel. Yeah. This knight has Your traveled friend. a long way to do battle at my father's request. Yes. On behalf uh -huh. of our people. I traveled from my couch. Forgive Coel. To words. my plane. These have been difficult times. And from my plane to your father. I am El Coel, lieutenant in the oh, Fadar Battalion, no, no and son of Leaf Coel. I traveled from my couch. Here among us, through my TV. To your brother. That, that, that's how it works. Indeed. Yep. I'm gonna you say that's how it works. A better time. If you wish to arm yourself with better, better weapons better time. and armor, what, what, then it may be that we time. can aid each other. Oh, I did come at a better time. Beyond the rock grotto are two fallen I could, trees I, which mark the goblin's cave. Yeah, come. In this cave, but you guys just like spent five minutes just yelling at me. I don't understand this. I'm just gonna skip it. Out of my face. I'm gonna go this way. Bye. And we're a bunch of losers. Oh, fire beetles. Fire beetles, I know they're coming. Where are you? Oh, there's one! Fire beetles are the bane of my existence here. Ah! You missed. Ah! Stop it! Come down! Give me a fire beetle eye, that's what I want. And I also know how to duplicate gems, but I probably won't do that just because, you know... What? You know... No, don't. I hate the aiming in this game. I hate it. Cool. Alright. Let's find some more beetles. Shove it. Right, I'm gonna try not to die at all this map. Or, um, this playthrough. Um, I'll probably die during the next boss just because I said this. For the first boss. I don't know if I'm gonna try it. Oh, that's right, there's a cheat back here. Ooh, a lot of things. Yay, more gate scrolls. I'm gonna have to use one here in a second. I don't believe I can use staffs, because the world cannot use two-handed weapons, apparently. Yep, no two-handed weapon. Of course. Of course I can't use a two-handed weapon. Entering the cave. Um, so, yeah, I... This is one of those games where, if you're into RPGs at all, this is definitely a great game. Oh <laughs> my! A bit more monster blood on the floor. Yep. I should have let you guys get that. I don't know if you heard it. Ow! That's cold. Okay, my controller is right away. Indicating that I'm There we go. They are dead. 
Okay, that is a shaman. Um, that is not good. Well, I have to go. I will get scroll out of here. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, all you guys, you guys won't see this, but I'm gonna save the game and then I will be gate scrolling right back there for part two. And peace. Hope you guys enjoyed.